this dude named Ahmoud Salam. He came to America to get away from bombs. And all he had to his name was a frame that contained a photo of a dame ate with pain. He said it kept him from going insane on that airplane ride to a place where sides have been taken over lies a place breaking inside and still more concerned with burning bridges outside. But that's not why he was emotionally fried. It was the guilt of leaving his family to die. So the minute he landed, he made a vow to get him out no matter how much he was struck him by the doubt. And it was something that you really had to see cause he was working 60 hours for a measly 83 cent raise on top of a $5 wage. And that's some shit that makes a grown man get a gauge, then get a gauge and let it wait before they even cut the cake. But he never, ever let it get to his head cause he just had to get them away from the bloodshed before they became a part of everything they dread. I used to know this dude named Ahmoud Salam. He came to America to get away from bombs. And all he had to his name was a frame that contained a photo of a dame ate with pain. Months had passed and he still felt a backlash of brash comments that he couldn't grasp. The ignorance was an unsettling task. Just cause he's from the Middle East don't mean he's gonna blast half the freaking country and all kinds of islands. All he was trying to find was something to confide in. But those stereotypes, they never quit. And no matter how difficult it was to get citizenship, we always looked at him like he might be a terrorist. If anything, we were the degenerate derelicts. Terrorizing innocent over some incidents that attacked the very fabric of these cities, state, and township. And it didn't take long to finger Salam The minute that he picked up a ticket to get his mom On a plane to the States They waved the red flags And said he better have a really good explanation Cause his green card was past expiration And it looked like he was up to something diabolical Too bad they had the wrong man He just wasn't methodical Enough to blow up a balloon Let alone a whole womb But it got them in detention for nearly a week until he snapped and strangled the guard with the sheet to get his keys, then flee there. Got off for a straight too bad they caught him at the gates and had to put him to sleep. I used to know this dude named Ahmoud Salam. He came to America to get away from bombs. And all he had to his name when he died was a frame that contained all the pain in his eyes. I used to know this dude named Ahmoud Salam. He came to America to get away from bombs. And all he had to his name when he died was a frame that contained all the pain in his eyes.